Hi there. I've just bought this bottle and I wanted to put uh, some drinks I've made into it. Um, but if you notice down here, it's got some lime scale and that's inside the bottle. It's very difficult to get rid of. Um, so I wanted to show you a very easy way to get rid of lime scale and without using any horrible nasty chemicals. What I'm going to use is a lemon. Hopefully you would have watched at least part one of my how to make a lemon cello video and in that I used a lot of lemons and I said that uh, don't throw the lemons away because you can use them for various things. What I did was I squeezed them and bottled them up. Bottle the juice up. That's I've used some of this but that's lemon juice. It's very easy to do. I'm just going to pop a funnel into the top there. Let's just move the camera up so you can see what I'm doing. Um, if you notice what I do with my funnel is I tape some, um, see if I can zoom in a bit closer there for you and give it a bit of a focus. There you go. I have secured three bits of cocktail stick to the side of my funnel using a, a rubber band and I do that so that when I pop the funnel in, air can still come out of the bottle. That's a good tip. You ought to um, try it. So I'm just going to pour in. A bit of lemon juice. That's about an egg cup full. It doesn't have to be much. And I'm going to put in a cork stopper. The corking isn't in that far. It's just so it forms a watertight seal. If you can see that. And I'm just going to lay that so that the liquid goes down to the end. Okay. Right, that's one hour up. Let's see how it's worked. And as you can see, all the lime scale is gone, as if by magic. So all we need to do now, take out the cork, get a nice clean dish damp dishcloth, stick it in there, give it a little wipe, and that, my friends, is a lovely clean bottle top. Thanks for watching. Oh, what I'm going to do is show you while I'm here the other problem I've got the dreaded label from the charity shop. And we've all been there. We go to pick it off and it won't come off. It, it tears. So I'm going to show you another trick how to get that label off. And the way I'm going to get rid of that label is by using a hairdryer. Of all the things that a bloke like me probably would never need is a hairdryer, but you'd be amazed how useful they are for things more than just drying hair. So I'm going to set it onto the hot setting. And just leave that on there for a few minutes. So it gets nice and warm. Okay, I've had the hair dry on it for about a minute now. I thought you wouldn't want to watch me just heat a label up. So just going to turn that off. And now the label peels off. And just that little bit there where I originally tore the label. Tra-la! Nice and easy label removal. Thank you very much.